What is going on guys? Today I'm going to be doing a review on the Marcus Ikea chair. Uh, I just picked this up like two days ago and I thought I'd do a review on it. So here it is. And then this is my old gaming chair. Right <coughs> chair went to way. Me and Shadi on the highway, going back to my place. We went in the driveway, park it in the driveway. You been like my chain, going to a high stage. She gon' come to my place, do whatever I say. Hey. Got a little shoddy, she off a molly, she in love with the drugs. Wanna fuck when I'm done, kick it out, no time to fun. If you talking, show me what's up, got a little tech with the drum. Now you quiet, how it's supposed to be, little nigga, you look dumb. But yeah, I been in your bitch in my space. But yeah, guys, here it is right here. It's actually uh, a lot taller than my other one, um, for comparison. And that's not as high as it can go, I don't think. Um, it can actually go pretty high. Um, <clears throat> but I think one of the best parts about it is that it lean back pretty far. So this one only go like it only like tilts back. This one, the chair actually moves, like, the whole thing moves here. I'll try to show you guys. So, yeah, this is how normal it is. And then this, it can move back like that. Um, right here, the, what it's made out of is 100% polyester. Um, it's just basically a shittier version of cotton, I believe. I don't know. But you could get another one. There's two of them, two of these chairs. This one was a hundred and sixty nine dollars, and then there was one there for two hundred and some dollars. And that was leather, so yeah, you're paying more if you want leather. But yeah, I find this headpiece is really comfortable. It's really good when you're gaming, but I recommend to lock it up because uh, you don't want to tilt back when you're gaming with your keyboard or controller. Um, yeah, you just don't want to lean back because it'd be uncomfortable, you know. But yeah, I recommend to lock it. And um, yeah, this stuff right here is not like this stuff right here. It's like this stuff is like, I don't know how to explain it. But like this chair, you see, I sat in this chair so much. But like, yeah, it has like my elbows there because that's where I put my elbows. It has all these wrinkles. But I don't think this chair will get wrinkles because that's like a fucking mesh. So. I don't think that can fucking wrinkle. Um, maybe this part will. Kind of is, but... Yeah, the, it, it was really easy to put together. Like, this desk I got from Ikea, this is the McKay desk. Uh, that took me, like... Fuck. I don't know, three hours to uh, build. But uh, th this one took me, like, not even an hour. It was so easy. Like So this came already built, and then this came already built with without these... Uh, hand or uh, fuck, I don't know, fuck, where go? Uh, armrests on them, but basically, all you had to do is attach that thing, like the stuff with the levers onto this, and then the wheels just snapped in. It was pretty easy, pretty straightforward. Um, yeah, it was really easy to put together. Not like any other IKEA desk. Like the desks are worse for that, but. Yeah, it's a really good chair for streaming or whatever. Uh, very comfortable. So yeah, that pretty much sums it up. If you guys like this video, I'm going to be coming with a bunch of content here uh, pretty soon. Uh, within the next week, I'm going to be coming out with a lot of content. Yeah, I'm going to be coming out with a lot of content in the next week. And I'm going to be doing a bunch of reviews on clothes. Um, I uh, ordered something from the... S spring summer 19 drop from supreme so i could do rev a review on that but yeah i think i'm gonna be doing a review yeah uh just comment down below what videos you want me to do in the future yeah subscribe and like see you guys in the next fucking video